सिद्धांत सरस्वती विजयते गौरी गोष्ठी पति वंदे गुरुपद्वंद भक्त बिंद समीचैतन्य प्रभु वंदे नितानंद सहोदित श्री नंदनंदन वंदे राधिका चरणोद गोपीजन सयुक्त बिंदवनम मनोहर वाछा कल्पतरुश के पास सिंधु भवच पतिथान पावन भवैष्णवेभ्यो नमो नम मुकोति वाचा लंग पंगु लंघयत गिरी यत्के पातमह वंदे परमाधव बृंदा वै तुलसीदेव वै पिया वै केशव सच स्नभक्ति पदे देवी सत्वत्व नमो नम नारायण नमस्कृत नरुंच नरोत्तम देवी सरस्वती व्यास तथो जयो मुदीर संकीर्तने कृष्ण कथोपदेश गौरीय पत्र प्रकाशने सदाक्त गुरु भक्ति युक्त भक्ति प्रमोदाक्ष जगोधर ध्येय सदा परिभवनमीष्टूहम तेथास्पद शिविरंजनुता शरण्य भेतात्ति हम पुनोपाल भवादीपूत वंदे महापुरुष ते चरुणारिंद यत्दपल्लवन कचंदमनी छटा विस्फुर्जीत कि बबूषुदर्श पूर्णागर सुसागर सारूर्ति साराधि कामयी कदा श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु नेतानंद श्री अद्वैत गाधर शिव सदी गौरभक्तबिंद श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु नेतानंद श्री अद्वैत गाधर शिव सदी गौरभक्तबिंद हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे आजानुलंबित भुज कनुका बुधा तो संकीर्तन कपितर कमलाताक्ष विशाबर द्विजर जुगधर्म पालो वंदे जगत प्रिय करो करुणाभतारो हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे नमा गंगे तब पाद पंकज सुरासुरवित दिव्यूपम भुक्ति मुक्ति दिनीम भावे न सदा नरन गंगा तरंग रमणीय जटा कलापम गौरी निरंतर विभूषी तवाम भाग नारायणो प्रिय मनंग मदापहारम वरानुशिपुरपति भज विश्वनाथ वागीशजुस्वने लक्ष्मीर्जस् च बक्षसी यस्ते हृदय संबीत सिंहमहम भजे हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे एवं प्रकृति वैचित्रा भिद्वते मतयो नीनम पारंपर्जेन के सांचित पासंड मतयो अपरे 
एवं प्रकृति वैचित्रा भिद्यते मतयो निनम परम परिजेन के सांचित पसन्न मतयो अपरे गौरीय गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी भोपा परमंश जगदगुरु सेट दैट स्लाइटेस्ट डिविएशन फ्रॉम द ट्रैक ऑफ योर गुरुपाद पद्म कैन थ्रो यू आउट ऑफ भजन गौरीय गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी भोपा परमंश जगदगुरु सेट दैट स्लाइटेस्ट डिविएशन फ्रॉम द ट्रैक ऑफ योर गुरुपाद पद्म can ultimately throw you away from bhajan but you cannot realize that is a fallacy you cannot really realize that you are deviated from the track of guru pad padma sila bhopad one day in chaitanya mon some senior devotee in the sense is he came before in this sense senior doesn't mean i am mean to say this is very elevated some a devotee some senior devotee he is speaking something against one brahmachari one or two brahmachari they are educated they are not going in pitching field nothing they are only sitting here in math this way they are criticizing one or two sanyasi they think they are the they think they are great preacher they are preaching on behalf of chaitanya mahap they thinking so so this way they are criticizing that brahmachari sanyasi hey uh, that that sanya do sanyasi criticizing the this brahmachari one or two then popad heard it after that popad coming out and shouting like lion who give you authority to speak anything against them who told you to speak anything against them you consented in your own seva i know what is there inside their heart and what is there inside your heart that i know you need not pass any remark i am acting as guru it is my duty to point out some for some fault with some some of my followers to rectify them with full affection mood affectional mood you have no idea why you are going to jump into fire why you are taking trouble to jump into fire to criticize other is my duty not your duty popad used to say i am bound to keep some show or so bottle you know so bottle you don't know so bottle mean in a bottle red green blue different kind of water are decorated into the into 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 a, into a showcase to show public here ayurvedic medicine available some false bottle some false bottle with some green or red water to so that public can understand the medicine available ayurvedic medicine pova speaking i am bound to keep some uh, show bottle show bottle mean only only to show for show because they anyway can go their health is very good long tall they can drink and after that i can do whatever i need to do treatment to them but they think they are exalted devotee they can do whatever they like they think so actually not that many time popad used to say it is my advice to you all many time popad used to say it is my advice to you all please concentrate in your own character behavior fault you try to rectify them it is my advice to you all please you try to concentrate in your own character behavior any mistake done by you you try to rectify it don't try to concentrate ha uh, don't try to concentrate your mind in uh, and in in the character of others and don't do it then you can lose your bhajan many people they have misconception about preaching most of the people out of 100% 99% people if not more they have misconception about preaching 
about these topics if possible tomorrow i can discuss what naraji maharaj heart from his guru mane brahma ji brahma wanted to give some advice to narad i want to give some some instruction about bhagavat tattva after that what brahma ji maharaj going to speak to narad that advice i can discuss tomorrow most of the people if not more 90% they have misconception about preaching preaching mean actually you will have to change the heart of others if you are failure to change the heart of others totally cannot give bhakti then it is not actual preaching then it can be cannot be called actual preaching somebody thinking that going to market and speaking hari katha kirtan this is called preaching popa speaking actually this is called actually canvassing try to understand the difference between canvassing and preaching canvassing suppose some company com some company product they like to canvass in different places going to speak about the about the utility of that object product their product this way they are going to they are going to speak about their product this call actually popad used to say it is canvassing many time popad told that platform speaker an actual hari katha not same platform speaker can speak all what he memorize he can speak no feeling platform speaker an actual hari katha there is a massive difference between between these two if you have 100% submission unto the lotus feet of guru pad padmo then and only then when you are enjoying full keep up gurudev then the question of preaching can come otherwise no or that that also following the track of guru pad padmo not that you can uh, play one brain and you can make some new path or oh, totally you will have to stay in the line of guru barga i mean our sautapantha whatever you are getting from guru barga what popa told bhakti mat that you will have to do but foolish people they don't understand they don't understand if prabhupad wanted to mean this kind of preaching cheap preaching try to understand not the question of fighting if prabhupad used to think that this kind of if prabhupad used to mean this kind of cheap preaching then he could easily advise to their representative what popad wanted to send that you can preach this way i already told never in the whole life popad never wanted to lose the standard that a many many time but you are overlooking you don't pay attention to the popad in his whole life never wanted to lose his standard always he wanted to maintain his standard so his hari katha writing everything having some standard he popad wanted to make lakhs of devotee he could easily make he could easily make by following some reconciliation procedure that popad never done so my question is that if popad wanted to if popad wanted to give instruction to this disciple to preach in very cheap preaching then he could give it. but he never give instruction on the contrary he told to preach about high level very nice preaching standard if there is a, there was a big assembly baligai sammelan you know baligai sammelan they are brahman vaishnav brahman vaishnav this argument was there popad was invited there bhakti mr tagore could not go because he was expressing sikh leela that time there popad wanted to explain the difference between vaishnavas and brahman contrast our those who are brahman in our society they think their position is very high and uh, the position of vaishnavas very low 
That's why before before leaving body, Prabhupada wanted to give instruction to Bhimala Prasad, you must try to implement the vichar of, you must try to implement the vichar of that uh, Doiva Varnasram. Doiva Varnasram, because Vaishnavas, they are many people, they are insulting Vaishnav. Many people, they are insulting Vaishnav. They are from low caste, these, that, so many. Those who are low caste, they are only doing, become Vaishnav this way. Bhakti Mantra told, many things instructed, two or three, four. One is don't go to Kali Brahmando, another is don't mix with any, don't get the association of, you know, material people, demon. This way so many, don't make any disciple. This way so many instructions Gaur Kishore Bhavaji Maharaj gave to Prabhupada. Gaur Kishore Bhavaji. But Bhakti Mantra leaving his body, he wanted to give three or four instructions men. One is you must do something concrete for the development of Dham. Development of Dham doesn't mean only material development. Bhakti Mantra wanted to mean very deep philosophy. Bhakti Mantra wanted to mean some deep, so that school, college can be there. And those professors, Vaishnavas, professors, they can give some. Like the case I told, huh? Bhagavan always wanted to keep some representative, like here we want Udva, Udva. When Bhagavan speaking to Pallad Maharaj, you will have to sit in the chair of in chair, uh, throne. Pallad Maharaj speaking, I don't like to sit. But Bhagavan said, no, you have to sit. Same thing happened with Dhruva Maharaj. Dhruva Maharaj told, I don't like to sit in chair of king, no. I don't like to sit. But Bhagavan said, you have to sit. Yudhishthira Mahas also never wanted to sit in the, in the chair, I mean the king, kingship, never wanted. But this was the idea of Bhagavan. Bhagavan wanted to, wanted to, uh, you know, wanted to make them king, so that their follower, whole country can learn something, follow. If the, if the man, if the king of this country is Vaishnav, then automatically, if the king of this country is Vaishnav, then automatically a whole country can get some influence. Na? This way, Bhagavan always wanted to do it. So, by making school, college, hospital, Bhakti Thakur didn't want to make material in improvement. The inner philosophy that if you can make some development, mane dham unnayan, dham, for the development of dham, that means if there is hospital, there is school, college, all other educated people can feel attraction, they can come and settle there, sit there. All small, small boys can go to school and college because that college and school inside dham, inside our Mayapur dham, Navadip dham, so those professors can give some basic idea about bhakti to them. This way, they can make foundation. Also, transportation facility mean, transportation facility mean, all some material people can feel attraction, okay, let us go. We hear the name of Navadip, they can come in Mayapur, have a darshan. This way, Bhakti Muttagur wanted to make. And after that, Bhakti Muttagur also told, Doiva Varnasram. Doiva Varnasram means material people, usually they are insulting Vaishnavas. Material people, they are usually insulting Vaishnavas. They are from low caste, these, there are so many things they are speaking. So, if Doiva Varnasram, this system can be established, I mean, implemented, then they can understand the Vaishnavas not depend upon their their caste or anything, they are not. They are totally separate. Bangshidas Babaji Maharaj took birth in a fisherman family. Gaurgishat Babaji Maharaj took birth in Vaishya family. Our Raghunath Das Goswami took birth in, in a Vaishya family. Haridas Thakur took birth in a Muslim family. So to prove, 
So to prove this is not important for Vaishnava. So to prove that it is not so important that Vaishnava must take birth in a Brahman family. Anywhere they take birth, they have always priya. To prove it, Bhakti Muttaku requested them that as per Bhagavatam, as per all authentic sastra, there is approved. There is already approved. That Daivya Varnasam. I already told. Viprat Disharagunat, Viprat Disharagunu Yutat Aravindu Nava, Pada Aravindu Vimukha Sapacham Varishtam. Viprat Disharagunu Yutat Aravindu Nava, Pada Aravindu Vimukha Sapacham Varishtam. One Brahman, having no faith in Vishnu, I mean Bhagavan, one Sapaj who used to eat a dog, dog by cooking dog, I already told. If he has bhakti, is far better than Brahman. Viprat disaraguna yutat aravindu nava padaravindu vimukha sapacham barishtam. This is the Sastra. Yasho yat lakshanam praktam pungsho varnavi venjakaha tadanatta dishe tattate naiva vini dishe. All Sastra going to say, according to the symptom, you will have to watch the character and symptom of that. According to that, you can place them. Yesterday in Hindi Kotha, I was speaking. That is why only one point foreign country took. Only one point they took from Vedic main point. That they are going to give honor to appropriate person. If there is some quality, they used to give some advantage. But here we are not giving. That's why they are making economical development, technical. Anyway, this is the fact. So, Bhakti Thakur told, you can try to implement the Daiva Varnasram because Vaishnavas, they are being insulted by outside people. They have no idea. And after that, you can do something from the development of this Dharma that you can do. And also, you can arrange Parikram, Dham Parikram. If you can arrange Dham Parikram, free of cost, surely free of cost, not paisa. Then all common people can try to get, take advantage of the parikram and that by this parikram and sadhu sangha, they can make some involvement. I am not speaking about the present situation. Bhakti Matogar surely never wanted to speak the present situation, what he is going. Bhakti Matogar wanted to say, big, big exalted devotee, they are speaking Harikatha Kit and their character behavior watching, there is no asasanga. There is there no scope of asasanga. This way, Bhakti Mahatma wanted to uh, request Prabhupada, Vimala Prasad, you can do it. So anyway, what I wanted to say, that in Balikai Sambalan, if Prabhupada wanted to make lakhs of devotees, Prabhupada could do easily. Prabhupada never wanted to, wanted to look for quantity. Always Prabhupada wanted to give importance to quality. So there, after the assembly is over, after hearing this kind of judgment, that Vaishnava, how exalted. Vaishnava is at the heart of Krishna. But Brahmanas, they think Vaishnava locus, that's why they are falling. Brahmanas are very high. So Prabhupada wanted to make some comparative statement and wanted to establish the separate the, you know, the supremacy of Vaishnavas. Absolutely. After the assembly was over, whole assembly, whole assembly, thousands of people, you cannot count, all assembly there. There were so many, many important personalities. Like Vishwamaranandu Dev Goswami, the, that time Acharya present, that time Acharya of Samananda Parivar, big exalted. Popat went there, so many. After the, after the conclusion is over, then whole thousands of people running towards Vopad to catch Vopad, to take blessing. Then the, after watching this situation, Vishwamaranda, they become very afraid. They wanted to arrange one big pot, water pot, big water pot. They wanted to touch the lotus feet of Vopad. Not possible. Then one big pot was arranged 
inside which the leg of Prabhupada, Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami, was, was put there, and after they started pouring water, fresh water. And they cannot touch Prabhupada. This cordon, cordon was made. After that, within, within a very short period of time, all water from that pot is over. Thousands of people taking it. Over. After that, there are those who arrange that assembly, big manager, or maybe there, there was a big assembly. They are requesting Prabhupada, if you agree that to make them disciple, then most of them they like to become your disciple. Most of them they like to take shelter onto your lotus feet after hearing you, your effulgence, teja, they like to. But only thing you will have to excuse, they are taking some tea, they are sometimes taking tea, sometimes khaini, they are taking, sometimes see, this you will have to excuse. Try to understand. Baba speaking, I don't like to make even one single devotee, single disciple here. I don't like to make any single devotee here. Try to understand the difference. If you don't have any biasness, easily Baba could approve their tea taking, everything. Oh, very small thing. So he could get thousands of devotees at a time. One fire, one fire, everything solved. But Prabhupada, say, Prabhupada said that I am less interested to make even one single devotee. Then everywhere, I told time to time, Prabhupada always wanted to maintain standard. Prabhupada never wanted to say cheap preaching. Prabhupada never wanted to mean cheap preaching. And now at present we are getting the result of the cheap preaching. Now we are getting the result of the cheap preaching. Cheap preaching. Popat never told, you can speak some cheap philosophy, cheap, you know, somehow, so that you can make some, Popat never told. If Popat wanted to mean so, Popat could himself do. Why Popat going to speak in Varanasi here, there, that I cannot come down to your level? I cannot come down to your level, but they are going to misinterpret. I cannot come down to, better I can allow by Prabhupada had bhajan power, very exalted. If Prabhupada, if you are really uh, inclined to Prabhupada, if you love Prabhupada, automatically power can go. Automatically, power can emit. Bhakti Muntava told one version of sitting, one pure version of sitting in one place. Somebody coming to meet with that Vaishnav. That Vaishnav not talking, not speaking anything. Maybe he is busy with something. Bhakti Tagore, only by sitting beside him, only by sitting beside him, he can get some power. Only by sitting, darshane pavitya kora itamargo. By giving darshan or purify. By giving darshan, he can purify. Bhakti Tagore used to do the same thing. Bhakti Tagore used to arrange Sahajya, Mane Santipur party, that Midanga, very nice kitam, very nice. And Bhakti Mantra used to sit there, used to sit there and close eyes and doing Harina. People thinking that Bhakti Mantra could allowing this kind of Sahaja kitam. Bhakti Mantra is sitting and doing Harina. All outside people think, oh, Santipur party, famous, we can go to see kitam. They are coming, they are hearing kitam. At the same time, they are watching Bhakti Mantra sitting in Asan and doing Harina. Bhakti Muntakur going to purify them by giving their darshan. Anyway, after watching with the Deccans, at least they are not doing Sastanga Pranam. As if they can say, don't know, they can do it. This way, Bhakti Muntakur very tactfully wanted to change the heart. But Bhakti Muntakur never wanted to speak any cheap philosophy. Go through Chaitanya, uh, use ch commentary of Chaitanya uh, Bhagavad, or go through. Jaiva Dharma, Chaitanya Sikshamita Neva. So, Prabhupada never wanted to mean cheap preaching. And repeatedly I told, massive preaching is a, is a fake term. Many times I told, but you are using, all, most, most of the people using, massive preaching was done. Massive preaching is a, is a very fake term. 
Massive preaching not possible. Massive preaching only was possible at the time of Gauranga Mahaprabhu. Gauranga Mahaprabhu and some of his devotees, like Samananda, Sanatan Rup not going outside. Samananda, Rusikananda, that time massive preaching was. Massive preaching is a fake term, not possible. How possible? Massive preaching, you cannot prove it is massive preaching. Mahaprabhu was success. Mahaprabhu wanted to preach massive way, multiple way. That massive preaching was possible. Samananda Prabhu also, Rosikananda. Samananda Prabhu giving instruction to Rosikananda. You give diksha to him. After the Rosikananda giving instruction to his disciple, you can give diksha. They have that, this kind of power. But our massive preaching means one kind of, you know, what is called canvassing. Massive preaching is what? One man you cannot change, even one man. One man, it is. Prabhupada himself told. Prabhupada himself told to, de to deliver one man from the jail of Mayadevi. Prabhupada himself many times told to deliver a man from the trap of Maya and to help him to reach the lotus feet of Bhagavan. So difficult. Mahamayar Karagat Theke Ekta Baddhajib Ke Udhar Kore Bhagavanir Charane Nitto Sevai Pounche Devar Mato Atavaro Parupokar Hote Parana. Bengali. Prabhupada used to say, that to deliver a man from the trap of Maya and to help him gradually to reach the lotus feet of Bhagavan to establish an eternal seva is so typical, so typical, not a matter of joke. Even one jiva, what to speak? Prabhupada himself told, they are written. Upadesha you can go, you can find. So magnificent. So Bhagavan Sri Krishna's wanted to give some advice to our Uddhavji Maharaj in such a way so that according to so that according to time and circumstances so that according to time and circumstances he can give suppose somebody coming his right according to his right Uddhavji Maharaj can advise. Same thing, keeping Arjun in front. Bhagavan Sri Krishna went on speaking about karma, mar, how to do karma, technique, karma, arpan. This way, same thing, Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking to Uddhav, don't think, don't think that I am giving all those different, 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 different kind of advice to you and you are in confusion. Not that. I am giving, I am giving all different kind of procedure, I mean, bichar, different kind of advice, so that you can test one, if somebody coming, you can test his situation, what is his uh, adhikar right, according to that you can speak. Because everybody, Everybody, if everybody you are giving, we are, if you are giving same advice, if you are going to give the same advice, then it is not possible. Everybody cannot accept. According to his condition, you will have to speak something, then he can develop his idea, conception, then you can. The slok I started with here also, Bhagavan speaking to Uddhav, same thing. That according to Evam prakriti by chitrat. According to the nature, Evam prakriti by chitrat. Vidyate matayo ninam. If same Guru Padma is going to give you some advice, if same Guru Padma, Sadguru, if same Guru Padma is going to give you some advice, same Guru Padma is going to give you some advice, so many disciples there. But after hearing, if you test each and everybody, you can see the result is different. This disciple accepting the advice of Gurudev this way, another going to advise the instruction this way, that way, all can differ. Not that everybody can understand same. All their understanding, all their relation is different, different according to their 
according to their own sanskar. Same thing I told happened with uh, Birochan and Indra. Brihaspati going to give Brahma Tattva to both of them, but Birochan, he understands something else, Indra understands something else, not same. Our Prabhupada speaking, like the seed of mango, like the seed of mango can give mango. Like the seed of mango, we can expect mango from that tree. The seed of you know blackberry, we can expect blackberry. Not that I am going to you know, put blackberry seed and I'm going to get mango. But at the same time, there's they are getting same Ganga water, suppose two or three trees. One is neem tree, one is blackberry tree, one is you know mango tree, same Ganga, same Ganga flowing. And the, all those trees, same Ganga flowing, same Ganga water, those trees are enjoying. Those Ganga water, they are enjoying same Ganga water, those trees enjoying same Ganga water. At the same time, same air, same air blowing there, same sunlight. But when, if you are going to watch the fruits, fruits, a tree can be known by the fruit it bears. So different, different. Same thing. Evam prakriti vaichitra bhidvate matoyo ninam. Due to different kind of sanskar, due to different kind of sanskar, different kind of realization, they are getting different, different realization. Same advice Prabhupada giving, but different, different, different devotees are. Different, different, higher. Evam prakriti prakriti vai chitra vidyate matayu ninam. This way, different kind of opinion develop. This way, after hearing Guru Pat Padmo, all different, different opinion developing. All different, different opinion. Though Guru Dev speaking same, but they are different, different opinion developing, different, different part. This way, they are. So, some of them following the track of Guru Padma exactly. Some of them following the track of Guru Padma exactly in total. Some of them diverted from the track of Guru Padma. That's why Bhagavan Sikh is not speaking. Evam prakriti vaichitrat bhiddhate matayu ninam. Param parjena ke sanchit. Mane some of them are in Sautapantha and Yet, some of them are going to follow fanciful attitude. This way, evam prakriti vai chitra bhiddhati matayo ninam param parjeno ki sanchit pasundo matayo open. Some of them become pasundo heartless. Some of them become heartless. Heartless, how can by their writing, speech, everything you cannot realize? By ignoring Guru Varga, ignoring Sampradaya. Easily you can, if you have your common sense, you can understand, deviate it, this way. So, Popat no, never wanted to, very vital thing, Popat never wanted to lose his standard, never wanted to mean. He never advised any Guru Bhargava, never such thing. Then you can come now, even Prabhupada told that I will have to play such a trick so that Actual Siddhanta Vichar, I mean absolute truth, public can accept. Usually, usually people are less interested to accept absolute truth. Very difficult. They are less interested. They are ready to accept some mixed philosophy. This is okay. This is also. I am hearing Harikatha, but this should not disturb my family life. If by hearing Arikatha I am going to disturb my family life in danger, I cannot. But absolute truth is absolute truth. You are approaching a mixing procedure. This way, pure devotion and practice is not. So, Bhagavan, Bhagavan speaking to Uddha, I am speaking so many things, but if you think that I am giving advice, everything for you, then it's not good. 
I am giving advice to you, different, different things, so that according to your, according to the adhikar of Jivatma, I mean man, you can give it. That's why. You, but you yourself can follow what he say. I mean, what I told to you, you leave everything and take shelter onto a lotus feet of my lotus feet, just like Burjavasi. Bhagavan wanted to say, just like Burjavasi, they are hundred, hundred percent inclined to me, the cell, they, they, they sold their life, already sold their life and so everything to me. You follow this one, but according to different standard, different, different understanding, realization, I mean capacity, you can go on speaking. So I am speaking so many things. So Bhagavan, he started speaking like different, different kind of seed. If you put into mud and give water, sunlight, everything, then gradually sprout can come and you can find one a nice, nice tree, this tree, that tree, different. So according to the seed, you are going to get the tree and you are going to get the fruits. So when Mahavishnu is going to look, when the time of creation coming, I told you, no? exhalation and annihilation. <coughs> when Bhagavan like to create again, when the time of creation after destruction, Long time waiting, Bhagavan with Jogumaya, Jogumaya, Bhagavan concentrating in Jogumaya. After long gapping, when Bhagavan again like to start creation, in that case Bhagavan can open eyes and look at Prakriti. So long, when Bhagavan was sleeping, long time, during that period, Prakriti, was in balancing condition, balance condition, no balance, don't know. Balance, balance, balance condition. Sato Rajo Tamo. Satogun, Rajogun, Tamogun, all when in balancing condition. No agitation. When Sato Rajo Tamo in puro balance condition, there is no agitation, up down. That is called balance condition. After that, when looking, when Bhagavan looking at Prakriti, after watching by looking at Prakriti, all the power, I mean all jivas, infinity jivas, so long they were all resting inside Mahavishnu. Then now, by looking at Prakriti, going to transfer all jivas. I mean, Mahavishnu going to throw all shit. Siddhna, or Jiva means Siddh. Your Sanskrit different. Har Singh say, hey, say the Bhagavan Mahavishnu is going to throw all Siddh into the field. Uh, Khetro, Maya. Balancing condition mean, balancing condition mean there is no agitation, up and down. When Bhagavan looking at Prakriti, then the first Shato Raja Tamo, is a balancing condition become disturbed when Bhagavan looking at Maya, Prakriti, Mahatattva one, nature, Mahatattva. There then Satoraja Tamagun become agitated, disturbed. When Satoraja become, become agitation, disturbed, agitated, then from Satoraja Tamagun, different, different kind of tattva developing. After that, finally this kind of creation file. But when all creation is like, you know, like unfolding, folding and unfolding, you know, you are going to fold, papers all you fold. Suppose some paper in, this is folding. You are going to fold one, one paper this way. Like orchestra, you want to see? Orchestra, those who are doing, folding and this. So, just like this you imagine. When creation is there, when creation is there, all unfolding. Prakriti, Satoraja, Tamagun, filled disturbance, agitation. After that, one by one, one step, second step, third step, this way, this is going to create this, this is going to create this. Finally, after that, this creation. Sargo, Bishargo, I am speaking, I am speaking in 
হিন্দি কথা স্বর্গ বিসর্গ স্বর্গ ইজ ভাস্ট ক্রিয়েশন ডোন্ট বি ইন কনফিউশন স্বর্গ মিন দ্য শ্লোক আই ওয়াজ স্পিকিং আই ওয়াজ স্পিকিং না ফ্রম ভাগবতম অত্র স্বর্গ বিসর্গশ্চ স্থানম পোষণ মুতয়ু মন্নন্তর ঈশানু কথা নিরোদ মুক্তির আশ্রয় হো আই স্পিকিং অল নাইন তত্ত্ব আর দেহ টেন তত্ত্ব অ্যাকচুয়ালি টেন্থ টেন্থ নাম্বার টেন তত্ত্ব ইজ আশ্রয় আই মিন সেল্টার অব এভরিথিং ইফ দিস ইজ গন অল বিকম জিরো সো অত্র স্বর্গ বিসর্গশ্চ স্থানম পোষণ মুতয়ো মন্নন্তর ঈশানু কথা নিরোধ মুক্তির আশ্রয় হো ফলো অত্র স্বর্গ বিসর্গশ্চ স্থানম পোষণ মুতয়ো মন্নন্তর ঈশানু কথা নিরোধ মুক্তির আশ্রয় হো মানে দের ইজ টেন তত্ত্ব হোল ভাগবতম হোল ভাগবতম হোল ভাগবতম ডিলিং উইথ টেন তত্ত্ব আউট অফ দ্যাট দ্য টেন হোল ভাগবতম ডিলিং উইথ টেন টেন তত্ত্ব অল টেন তত্ত্ব বাট নাম্বার টেন্থ নাম্বার টেন্থ তত্ত্ব টেন্থ টেন্থ টু প্রুভ দ্যাট টেন্থ তত্ত্ব টু প্রুভ দ্যাট টেন্থ নাম্বার তত্ত্ব অল নাইন তত্ত্ব আর ওয়ার্কিং অল নাইন তত্ত্ব গ্র্যাজুয়ালি ওয়েন্ট টু দিস ইজ দ্য সেল্টার অল নাইন তত্ত্ব আর মেন্ট ফর অল নাইন তত্ত্ব all nine tattvas are there to clarify the tenth tattva all different ninth preliminary nine tattvas are there to clarify the number 10 tattva which is the most vital point i mean it is called support asray asray tattva so sargo mean so what do you mean by sargo sargo mean vast creation mane all cosmic vast creation all star and planets they it all brahmando clarify to the clarify this one all different brahmando try to vast vast creation vast creation as a whole i mean countless brahmando created by bhagwan count the space is the space you see also created by bhagwan or space air everything coming after eh so all vast creation what you see i mean each each brahmando countless brahmando it is called sargo and bhayan when mahavishnu karunano sai going to enter into each and every brahmando introduce himself into each brahmando then he is going to take the name of garbhadoga sai vishnu and from garbhadoga sai vishnu navel portion one lotus flower coming out there brahma discovered himself then after the so many thing i don't like to discuss like to discuss then finally power was given by bhagwan sri krishna for creation to brahma after that bhagwan created how you know created chatushloki bhagavat already there চতুশ্লোকী ভাগবত লাস্ট শ্লোকা চতুশ্লোকী ভাগবতম লাস্ট শ্লোকা ইউ কেন রীতি অর্থম যথপ্রীতি নপতি আত্মি তদ্বিদ্ধ আত্মান মায়ম যথা বাস যথা যথা মহান্তি ভূতানি ভূতেশু উচ্চ পচেশু প্রবিষ্টান্ন উপবিষ্টানি ন তেষু ন তেষু এতাবদেব জিজ্ঞাসন তত্ত্ব জিজ্ঞাসন আত্মন অন্যায় ব্যতিরিক্যাভ্যাম যৎ সর্বস্ব এতদ্মতম লাস্ট শ্লোক লাস্ট শ্লোক ভগবান স্পিকিং টু ব্রহ্মা এতদ্মতম সমাতিষ্ট how we know bhagwan given bhagwan already gave power to brahma how we know bhagwan speaking etat matam samadhisto what is what knowledge i am giving to you etat matam samadhisto parameno sabadina etat matam samadhisto mean whatever divya gyan i am giving to you you must you must get established in the tat of fully not slight gap gaping পরমেন সমাধিনা এতমতম সমাতিষ্ট সম্যক নট দ্যাট ইউ অ্যাকসেপ্ট ইট নট দ্যাট কমপ্লিটলি হানড্রেড পার্সেন্ট এতমতম হোয়াট অ্যাডভাইস আই হ্যাভ গিভিন টু ইউ ইউ হ্যাভ টু গেট এট এস্টাবলিশ ইন হানড্রেড হানড্রেড পার্সেন্ট দে শুড নট বি এনি গ্যাফিং 
Bhagavan Sri. So, etat matam samatishto parameno samadhina. Etat matam samatishto parameno samadhina. With full concentration, you will have to accept all everything. Bhavan, you, Bhavanu kalpa vikalpesu na vimuhyati kahichit. Bhagavan speaking, I am giving you such a seva. I am giving you such a seva. I mean creation seva. Vast creation, Bhama not doing. Vast creation, I told, is called Sargo. It is done by Bhagavan. But when each Brahmando, Brahm, Bhagavan entering, then from the Nebal said, Paddha coming, Brahma discovered. After that, when advice was given to Brahma, then Bhava, Brahma getting power for creation. Follow. And that creation name is Visargo. So in Bhagavatam, you can open. Bhagavatam, you can find this sloka. Visargo. Visargo. Visargo means Vishesh Sargo. Special creation. Special. So, Sargo, Visargo. This way. So, Bhagavan speaking, it is one kind of blessing. It is not speaking. Bhagavan giving one kind of blessing to Brahma. Even you are busy giving one kind of blessing. To whom? Brahma. Bhavan, Bhavan means you, even after taking this responsibility of creation. Because creation, creative thing, creation is one kind of Rajagun matter. Rajagun, those who are motivated by Rajagun, influenced by Rajagun, they have to try to do this, that, yes. I said, do this. If no Rajagun, Rajagun must be there. Otherwise, all activities can come to chance. Rajagun, give me the give. Do it, do it. So, this way, Bhagavan giving blessing to Brahma. Ya Bhavan kalpa bhi. Etat matam samatishto. If you are going to get established in the tattva 100, 100%, totally, then, though you are going to take the responsibility of creation, which is really Rajagun matter. So you cannot feel disturbance. You cannot feel, it is my blessing. Etat, etat matam samatishto bhava, etat matam samatishto parameno samadhina bhavano kalpa vikalpesu na vimuhyati koi. Though it is very complicated, creation you have to feel, you can feel disturbance naturally. This creation, this thing, disturbance, this, but it is my blessing to you, you cannot feel disturbance, you cannot feel disturbance, it is my blessing. Bhavanu kalpa vikalpesu na vimuhyati karishit, never you can feel disturbance. So, creation is one kind of unfolding matter, unfolding. This, after that opening mystery, from there this, this, and ultimately in full fragile form, we are watching this creation. It was not at a time. It was just opening the uh, fold in our orchestra, no? We open fully, then you can, like one folded thing. Folded. Then after that first Bhagavan giving this, after the second fold, third fold, fourth fold, this way opening. Similarly, when, when the creation can, uh, uh, no, it is unfolding. And when I am speaking of folding, just opposite, reverse. First of all this, after that Bhagavan comes to the, the, this is the final reason, from there you can go back to the second reason for why it happened, second, third, third reason, original reason, for, from third reason, the second reason happened, just like scientific research. Third reason to previous reason, previous reason to previous reason, all. This way, finally, when all the, all, all the reason, I mean all matter, when unfolding previously, and now, eh, you know, follow, unfold, then you submerge everything. Then whole creation is over, you cannot see, only and only Mahavishnu sleeping. Concentrating in Yogamaya, this is called creation, very complicated. So, so, when Bhagavan Vishnu, like you have seen uh, in any factory you have seen, na, especially in India, foreign you cannot see, one one factory, thousands of labor working. 
they have some particular place of putting their cycle, you know, cycle, labor. They are coming, putting cycle, and after that, they are all cycle are there. And they are going to do their seva, I mean service, not seva, service. After that, they are coming back, they are taking each of their, their cycle, their respective cycle, going to home. If a cycle is standing, cycle, if you push one, one cycle, then this cycle can dash the second cycle, second cycle can dash the third cycle, fourth cycle, whole cycle standing, cycle can fall down. This is the matter. This way, so Bhagavan speaking, in the form of Jiva, I am there. In the form of Jiva, you are there. What wrong in it? What wrong in it? I already told, na? Bhagavan speaking, Jivatma came from me. Bhagavan speaking, na? Mamai Bhamsa Jiva Lupa Jiva Bhuta Sanatana. Mamai Bhamsa Jiva Loka Jiva Bhuta Sanatana. So what wrong in it? Shakti, Shakti, Matar, Abed. So Jivas are non-different power. So Bhagavan speaking, in the form of Paramatma also there, and Jivatma also coming from me. So what wrong in it? In the form of Paramatma, Bhagavan inside there. Also Jivatma where from coming? From Bhagavan. So if Jivatma already I told, is Shakti Tattva, Tattva Shakti, Chief Shakti. So what wrong in it? Shakti, Shakti, Matur, Abhid. Even I told in six different chakra, six different chakra, finally this is Brahma Ranga. This I am not counting up to these six chapters here. Bhagavan speaking, I am staying in all, manifesting myself in six chakra. In course of their realizing power, from here, I am increasing this. Hello. And I told you, it is called Agha Chakra. Here, though Paramatma, maybe some misconception can be there. Maybe some misconception can be there. You can think, I, because I, I couldn't get my time to clarify, Paramatma staying inside. Now, yesterday I told Bhagavan speaking, Uddhav, how Veda developed. It was there finally inside my navel portion of that, that how many was there. Para, Pashanti, Madhama, Vaikari, this way. So, Bhagavan staying in different chakras, manifesting himself in different six chakras. This is called Agha Chakra. So, Paramatma, Bhagavan is one, Paramatma staying inside. That Paramatma manifesting himself as Chaitya Guru here. This I didn't clarify to you. Paramatma is one, saying in, in us, Paramatma. That Paramatma manifesting in six chakra, manifesting in throughout the six chakra, gradually. And this is called Agha Chakra, finally. Here, Parma, here Paramatma is staying in the form of Chaitya Guru. If I don't clarify, you can think Chaitya Guru means Bhagavan. Not separate, Tottayaki, same. So, this way Bhagavan told, Je actually everything came, Veda and all karma kando of Veda inside, all gradually everything came from me. Because I myself and Veda are non different from each other. Veda and I myself no different. This point Bhagavan wanted to clarify to Uddha. Veda and I myself no different. Veda, I, I come in the form of Veda. Vedasya Ishwar Atmatvat. Vedasya Ishwar Atmatvat Tatra Muhyant Surayo. Because, because Ved in, because Ved is non different from Bhagavan, that's why all big, big personalities, they're in confusion to understand anything about Veda. Vedasya Ishwar Atmatvat Tatra Muhyant Surayo. Surya means Dibba Suri. They can understand everything. But where they are going to try to realize what is inner meaning of Veda, they are also in confusion. What can be the actual meaning? So Bhagavan speaking, Vedasya Ishwar Atmatrat Tatra Mahyanta Surayo. Even Surayo, they have big understanding, they are knowledgeable, but still they are in confusion. They can understand. Because I myself, 
coming in the form of Veda. So, Bhagavan wanted to say, Uddhav in the form of this creation, Uddhav in the form of this whole creation, in the form of this whole creation, I myself there. Because Bhagavad Maya, Bahiranga Maya coming from, from Bhagavan. Bahiranga Maya from where coming? Bhagavan from Bhagavan. Is the transformation of the external potency of Bhagavan. How from Mahatattva, I told you, gradually is creation sticking. So, all whole creation, I myself coming in this form. I am. And in the form of Jiva, also I am. In the form of Jiva, in each Deha, body, also. So, without me, you cannot find anything. Without me, you cannot find anything. If you search out your cloth, go to laboratory for testing, only, only thread you can, same thread, nothing else. Whole cloth is a fabrication of some, some thread. So what you can find? You can find nothing, only cloth. So, like the solution, like the solution of salt in a water, everywhere you can find Brahma, I am everywhere. Nowhere you can find, truly speaking, truly speaking, if, you can, if your realization can go up to that far, if your realization, someday, then you can find Bhagavan is playing with himself. If someday, if this kind of understanding coming, realization, you can find no problem, no tension. Who is, who is, who is I myself? Bhagavan is actually playing with his own image. Like in Rasa Leela, Sukhdev Goswami told, Sukhdev Goswami told, Pratibhimma Vibramaha. Like inside, in front of mirror, one boy can play with the mirror. Similarly, similarly, this is happening. Bhagavan actually playing with himself. And each one of us, because of our false ego, each one of each one of us, because of our respective false ego, we are thinking, I have some separate identity, I am a separate personality, this is my honor, this way. Because of our all separate, separate false ego, we are going to locate ourselves, identify ourselves as a separate personality from Bhagavan. We are all separate, separate. Actually, not that. This kind of relation, so uh, many times before I told, Vishwarup Darshan means everywhere you can find Bhagavan, your Ishtodev, right? Like Mahaprabhu told to Ramananda. Mahaprabhu told to Ramananda, na? When Ramananda, what I see, just now I find something. Govinda and Radha, Mahaprabhu like to hide. Actually, you are a great devotee. That's why wherever you are looking, you are watching your Ishtadev. Finally, finally, when Rayanamandu wanted to arrest Mahaprabhu, he was bound to confess. Well, you are right. I am same. Rasaraj, Rasaraj Mahabhav, say Yakru. I am Rasaraj, Krishna. And Srimati Radharani, my internal Buddhist. And I am submerging Gauranga. Rasaraj Mahabhav, Hoy Yakru, Yak, same. So, if you can go up to that far, you can find no tension. Because Bhagavan Himself playing with Him. To be frank, like a child playing with the toys, unmindfully. One boy, small boy, playing with his toys, unmindfully. Even Musulman, Musulman uh, poet, Musulman poet, his mother was Hindu, devotee. Who is writing Kavita verse? Those who are writing verse, no? Kavita. His mother was Hindu and father was Muslim. By chance, he developed, like Salvek also. Mother was Hindu Brahmin girl. Somehow, that Muslim you know, king abducted that lord, Mary, after the son was Salvek, for whom great devotee, for whom Jagannath came outside. And from Lion Gate, you can see now Jagannath, that for him, Jagannath came out of throne 
when Salve crying, when Salva crying, they are not allowing me to, to take your darshan. They are not allowing me to go inside to take your darshan. But my mother told, I will have to meet with you. Then he is crying, he is speaking, your name is Jagannath. Your name is Jagannath. I mean, you are the Lord of infinity universe. So I am out of that universe. I am within your creation. How they are not going to allow me to take your darshan? How? They think I am late show, I cannot take darshan. Why? Then Jagannath was very much, ex you know, very much excited. Jagannath immediately coming from his throne and coming in the gate of Patit Pavan Jagannath. And from then onward, from that time, previously, previously there was no Patit Pavan. That Patit Pavan Vigraha came after. Our Gurudev also used to speak this such story. Bandhu Mahanto, Salve, very important one. Time to time, Bandhu Mahanto, Guru Maharaj used to speak. And Salve, Jayadev, so many devotees. So, Bhagavan Jagannath coming outside, uh, coming from his throne, running and giving darshan. That his name is Salvek. He was Muslim. Same thing happened in Vrindavan with uh, uh, Ras Khan. Time to time, I Ras Khan, Musalman. He was successful to, to see Sinat Gopal. Sinat Gopal playing in the field with coward boys. So, how possible? So, Salve crying and speaking that your name is Jagannath. So, infinity world manifests for me. So, I am out of, I am out of this uh, universe or Jagat, so that they are not going to allow me. Other kind of element, how, same thing happened with, uh, with Ch uh, Chatushan, when the gate man not going to allow them in Baikuntha. Hey, why you are not allowed? No, you are not allowed. You foolish. Who can reach Baikuntha, you don't know. Any foreign element can reach Vaikuntha? Not possible. But they are going to stop. This way, actually, all jivas, Bhagavan speaking to Uddhav, in the form of all whole creation infinity, also in the form of these jivas, because if jivas are not there, you can find all matter. Yesterday you told me, if Bhagavan withdraw all jivas immediately, all matter, dead body. So you see the unique procedure, all, all prakriti is there. At the same time, jivas all according to their karma fall, they are giving shit. Prakriti is like one field. And the field, here you are putting mango tree, you are putting say some banana trees, and this way. You Same field. So, in the field, when Bhagavan going to see all jivas by eyesight, all jivas going enter into the womb of Mother Prakriti, then according to the previous sanskar, somebody, somebody taking the form of tiger, somebody lion, somebody snake, somebody... Bhagavan, how nicely explaining Uddhav, it is one kind of magic. By this creation, you get hypnotized. You are going to locate yourself, oh, I am also in this case. Actually, there is nothing. All Brahma, all around. Only due to their, due to their respective sanskar, I mean, Abhiman, false ego, they are going to identify themselves separated from Bhagavan. Otherwise, our eternal relationship with Bhagavan is eternally present. Who is going to break? Nobody can break. Father and son relationship must be there, though son is missing. Many such cases. Son is missing for two years. Where gone, nobody knows. But the relationship is there. Father thinking about son, son thinking about father. Relationship is not. When son can come back, then can call father, call, is, you are my father. When son can... When son can come back, then can call, you are my father. But now not speaking, because he is missing. This is. So this way, I was yesterday speaking, 
this whole world, Bhagavan speaking, whole world, Bhagavan speaking, is creation. This whole world can be compared with a tree, big tree. This whole creation is one kind of tree. Urdhva Mulam Adho Shakyam. This tree having so many branches and having bearing the fruit, fruit of you know pain and pleasure, everything or vice and virtue, whatever you say, ana, eh? this you can get. This you can get this way, and each and every body personified, one of one, also can be compared with three. Also, this can be compared with three, because our desire. All our desire on Navilas going to go deep into the root. When, the, when a tree growing, when a tree growing, there is a root going inside mud. If you wait for a long time, 100 years, 50 years, then where the root reaching, we don't know. I wonder how the power of this root, how the power we have seen breaking the stone in one temple, there was one, uh, you know, what is called, not Banyanti, there is called uh, Ashatta, what is called, uh, 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 I speak all the time, uh, people, people tree. People tree, in temple I have seen, that the man who is giving donation to make that, is speaking that people see, you should not cut. It coming inside the Nattaman, you going. But we need to, we need to take the whole place to make Nattamandit. But the man speaking, uh, you cannot cut this people tree. People tree is Vishnu. People tree is Vishnu. Arjun tree, Arjun tree is, is, is Shankar. Try to understand. Arjun, you have seen? You don't know Arjun tree. <laughs> Arjun, the skin of Arjun tree is good for heart. Arjun tree, I don't know what is it. So, people tree, is the symbol of, symbol in the form of people tree, Vishnu coming, in the symbol, in the form of, you know, Arjun tree, Shankar Bhagavan coming, in the form of Palas, Palas, Palas tree, Palas, Palas Bhikkhu, very pure tree, Brahma coming, Palas. What is the English? I don't know. I forget. I didn't think it necessary to know. Palas. Big, big leaf, you know, Palas Pata. Palaspata, you don't know. You could go to uh, some place, big, big. Kad, like Kadamba Pata, Palaspata is more. You can make a leap of Palaspata to take for the very nice. Especially this breath of pure. So this way, this way actually, I have seen how powerful the root of tree going to break. All stone, nobody hammering. Day by day, we see the tree going to break all stone. Big stones, white stone, going to break everything. So, the power of the root when going down, how powerful they are going to reach. This way, all our different kind of desire, different kind of annavilas going deep, like the tree, going deep, and we cannot get free. This is one kind of bondage. We can never get free. The tree, the branches, branches mean all your desire, everything, going deep and going to fix up. If you like to go up, you cannot go. All fix up. If you like to go up, you cannot go. Fix up. Then, finally, Bhagavan can say how Gurudev can cut that root, cut, and the tree, all the root can become uprooted. You can then finally you can find yourself free from bondage. Previously you can find loosely attached. After that, finally eradicated. After that, you are free. Then and only then you can go up. But before that, there is no scope. Forcefully you cannot go. This is the procedure. Bonded soul, they we can wait with the tree. All their desire or annavila is going to fix them up in this world. Nobody going to, nobody going to, nobody going to be, you know, you cannot uh, speak that he is responsible, he is responsible. 
you yourself is responsible. That's why Bhagavan told Gita Uddhare. Uddharet Atmana Atmanam, Uddharet Atmana Atmanam, no Atman no Ivavu You try to help yourself. You try to help yourself, first of all. You try to help yourself. You are not doing justice with yourself. You are not doing justice with your Atma. Uddharet Atmana Atmanam. You yourself is a traitor. You are going against Guru Vaishnava and giving. Hey, he is responsible for me. He is responsible. Whom to blame? Whom to blame? You yourself to be blamed. Uddharet Atmana Atmanam no Atman no This we can discuss again. So, the sloka I started with Evam Prakriti Vaishitvad Vidyate Matayo Ninam Param Parjeno Kesanchit Pasanda Matayo Apare Vanchakalpatrushiki Basindu Patitanam Pavanabho Vishnabhyo Namo. Vaan chakal bhut.